how do we care about something we never see or experience? I've been incredibly fortunate to explore and study coral reefs around the world for about 15 years. And I watched as the places I came to know and love were devastated by the recent global bleaching events that was unprecedented in scale and severity. Higher than normal ocean temperatures caused corals to turn white and die, which can destroy the entire ecosystem. And it was heartbreaking to see these important habitats degrade so rapidly. And it was also really hard to watch as the resulting scientific reports did not clearly lead to public understanding and local protections and climate action. This mobilized me to co-found The Hydras, a nonprofit devoted to ocean education. One of the things we do is lead expeditions, developing and training citizen scientists, and gathering visual records of coral reefs, including 3D models collected with underwater photogrammetry. With support from National Geographic, we are developing ocean education kits for middle school students. With our 3D models, students can build their own reef. And when they increase the temperature in the aquarium, the corals will start to turn white. The thermochromic materials we use help display and explain how bleaching thresholds vary by species, morphology, and location. Learners will discover the fascinating symbiosis between coral and algae and figure out what it takes to bring color back to the reef. We can't bring everybody to the ocean. So we're trying to find scalable ways to bring the ocean to everyone. And virtual reality and ocean environments are just a match made in heaven. We're currently developing a virtual reality film as well as immersive and interactive learning modules from 360 degree underwater footage we've collected on coral reefs. And it is totally magical. And VR has the ability to connect people to places they would not otherwise visit. And based on the leading research, it's a promising method of science learning as well as generating empathy. This year is International Year of the Reef. I hope you'll all learn more about these beautiful and threatened places, even if you never see them. And I hope you'll think about how you can use design and new technologies to share and protect the places you love. Thank you.